Hold on, I'm trying to get the music to play. There it goes. There we go. I'm listening to some Wind Waker music because it is my favorite. One of my favorite uh, Legend of Zelda games in terms of the soundtrack and whatnot. I have to get the get this quite right because <laughs> anyway um so i took some time and got a bunch more uh uh resources for different vtubers together so we've got a good selection to choose from we're not it's mostly to avoid the uh potential uh, run into a situation where I run out of cards to make and we just kind of stare at each other awkwardly. So. There's something on my monitor. There we go. Alright. Um, I don't remember quite where we left off last. I guess we could start at the bottom. Well, there is one I wanted to do because um, I recently just uh, graduated. Um, oh, the video froze. Hold on. Okay, we're back. <laughs> Uh, pretty sure it's that. Yep, this one. Trying to change up my music selection because I usually try to play more chill music, usually some Animal Crossing stuff, but my body likes to decide on Saturdays that it is time to just crash and burn. Uh, you know? So. <laughs> uh, I kind of wish it would do that on Sundays, not Saturdays, but it is what my body, it, it is what it is, my body does what it wants, I guess. But, so I'm trying to listen to music that's a little less uh, gonna make me fall asleep kind of thing, you know? I don't, so I'm not quite as lethargic during my <laughs> Saturday streams as I tend to be. Anywho. this right there um been a little bit since we did one of these so just trying to get my brain to reset Thank you. 
give him a good send off. Uh, I know they graduated yesterday, so I missed it, but <laughs> or no, it was two days. Was it two? Was it yesterday? No, it was two days ago. It was two days ago. But oh well, <laughs> it's fine, probably. Um. So it does have some of the same, some of the same general colors as uh, false ID. With a light blue there. There we go. Uh, for this, I think we'll do, maybe we'll do that golden color. Ah, uh, it might not work out too well. If we go darker with it, maybe it'll be better. No, that's, there's still something not quite right about it. It's just not blending well with the surrounding colors ah, it's too much of an eyesore and maybe that's just me it could just be my color blindness that's causing the issues Uh, I don't know, that doesn't seem quite right, you know? Not bad. But here's a thought, what if we made this one gold? Oh, no, no, absolutely not. Holy, that was a very bad idea. All right. Let's try a little deeper. No. Yeah, I think this color's good. I think this one works. Yeah. I like it. Okay, what are we going to do with this? There's a real question there. Yeah, that works. <laughs> okay.
artist name. Oh, got to take the logo and bring it to where we need it. Okay. Oh, okay, there it goes. <laughs> I lost my mic for a second there. We're back. All right. Okay. Uh, I had to blow my nose or something really bugging it. Okay. Now we just need to start, now we need to set up the saving point. I guess we go back to where we left off before. Still not sure what to do with Goonies because I don't know the artist name on that one. Uh, Dufua. I've missed some of the Wind Waker music. I really have. I need to play that game again. I love that game. I don't know if I'd say it's my favorite Legend of Zelda. Ocarina of Time still holds a very special place. But, I do enjoy Wind Waker very much. I still remember when Wind Waker was first announced, how much people were, get, were hating on it. Because it was too cartoony. Childish. People thought that was going to be a big detriment. And then... <laughs> then there was the opposite... The, like a complete 180 when Twilight Princess came out. And they're like, oh, this is too dark. It's like, okay. Wind Waker was too cartoony. Twilight Princess is too dark. Like, what do you want? <laughs> Are you going to be happy with anything? <laughs> it was a big no. People were just going to complain. But... Thank you. 
I feel like this middle might be better with that bluish, purplish, whatever color. No, I like how we had it before. I just cannot decide on a good color scheme for this. Um... Let me see if I can find, if I can get Hua's model or reference sheet or something, maybe I can uh, pull together something that looks a bit better. Go. Let's see if I can find something. I could have sworn I've seen a Fuo reference sheet before, but it probably could have easily been a while back. I think she's gone through a couple different model phases since uh, I've uh, been following her, but uh, this, they all kind of keep the same general color scheme. The problem I'm having here is that Fuo's color scheme works for her and everything, but it does make things a tad bit tricky in terms of card colors. At least for me. I don't know, maybe that is, maybe that's just me. Doesn't blend quite right. Hmm. This is proving to be very tricky. What the heck happened? Not the right color at all. I remember this music. This is when Link falls off the bridge trying to chase down the giant bird that takes his sister.
Oh, sad grandma music. <laughs> Oh, something about this still doesn't feel quite right. I feel like it... I just can't put my finger on it. Maybe it's just in my imagination. It seems fine. Oh, hey! Hey, Zal. Sorry, I was very... <laughs> very focused. Oh, the chat box isn't working again? Hold on, let me... Oh, that's why. The chat, the chat box is, was, uh, the chat box was off in the corner somewhere. For, oh, that's, that's right. I changed the size of the chat box to fit my gaming overlay better, and I forgot that I would need to move it because of that for this. All right. Yeah, it was into the void, basically. Yeah, we're all good, but thanks for uh, thanks for bringing that to my attention so I can remember to do that. All right. Uh, the cards are coming along well. I've got I've got a whole slew of new VTubers to work with, as you can see by all of these. I gotta I gotta be honest. It can be really hard to do this with certain VTubers. Finding a piece of artwork for certain uh, people that would that uh, Twitch wouldn't bonk me for is shockingly difficult sometimes. And all I can say is why? <laughs> why are VTubers like this? <laughs> Obviously not all, but many. Many VTubers are like that. And it's like, that's cool if that, like, I don't care if that's, like, the artwork you're cool with, but, like, I can't use that. <laughs> I can't use that. So some of these are, some of these may be a little closer to the line, I don't know. Like, Great example would be um, uh, Tane. I know she's very popular, but like this is the one art piece I could find that I could actually use. <laughs> um, uh, crap, what's her name? <laughs> I blinked. Yozora. Another one. Coco Nuts is another one. She's very fun. Her streams are a lot, are very entertaining, but like... Holy crap, was a pain in the butt to find out. <laughs> it's the mixture of... A, it needs to be an art piece that l would look good and look natural on a trading card. B, it needs to be one that's... a enough of either a portrait or has enough in a landscape setting to fit into the shape of the trading card and then three needs to be one that i can put on there that twitch won't bonk me for <laughs> it took a lot of searching for a few of them but uh so a lot of the new people, a lot of the new ones that I've added are people that I have done clips for in the past. So the first two batches were people that I follow both on Twitch and Twitter. And then this, this third batch is people that I've done clips for 
the fourth batch will probably be the same, and then I will figure out what to do after that. <laughs> I'm just trying to stick with uh, VTubers that I'm more familiar with because that it's easier for me to find all of the resources I need <laughs> if I have a quick oh here they are and here's the twitch because I follow them on twitch because or here's a link that I use to do a clip for them or whatever and I have those all stored so I can just jump to things and grab resources and but not uh... Oh, also another criteria for art pieces I, is I need to know the artist's name. I would like to know the artist's name. It's kind of important if I want to give credit to an artist. <laughs> kind of need their, uh, kind of need the name. I think there are two art pieces currently that I don't have artist names for uh, it would be this one this one for one of junks and this one for Goonie I don't have the artists names for those so I can't really use those ones even though they fit the yeah the other criteria I can't <laughs> I can't use them in good conscience without noting the, knowing the artists name Is the CH like a set part of her name? Ooh, uh, I don't... I don't know. Because <laughs> the CH is in all... In, in, like, on everything. I guess I'll just put it. I mean, it's not on the logo, but it's in, like all of her channels and everything, so I guess I'll just put it. Man, it was shockingly hard to get the right color scheme for this one. I'm still not 100% happy with it. I don't know. Some, there's just something that's, like, bugging me in the back of my mind about it. Oh, maybe that's what it is. I just got a close-up shot of the picture. I think I figured out what's wrong with it. What's going on with it. So, when I zoom into this, when I'm looking at this, I don't know if this is true for everybody, but what I'm seeing is this is, feels like watching those old 3D movies without the 3D glasses on. Like, the colors are, like, separating. I don't know if that's on purpose or not, but, like, there's, like, the yellow here... And then like a red in the middle and then a blue over here i think that's what's throwing me off so much with this with this one it's just like that ah. <laughs> maybe maybe that's what it is maybe that's why i just can't quite yeah i don't know what the effect is called it's an interesting effect though that's for sure Dramatic aberration. Okay. I'll keep that in mind so that I never use it. <laughs> I don't want to ever use that. That is painful to look at for extended periods of time. Uh, Toma had an extra piece to hers. I need to link these. Oh, I forgot to make a outline copy for her. Hey, Melkor, how's it going? What the? 
Apparently, linking layers does not actually move them together. <laughs> nice if it did. Just chilling. Nice. Your favorite artist is uses a mixture of chromatic aberration and noise to create to great effect. Yeah, I don't doubt it can be incredibly well done. I just why is this? Oh, I needed to bright that. I don't know. Maybe it's just because of my color blindness or something. I tend to blame my color blindness for everything, but I feel like it's pretty fair. <laughs> I am exceptionally color blind. So, <laughs> three those kind of 3D movies always bothered me because I would even get some of that color aberration, the, the aberration even with the 3D glasses on, and it's just, bleh. Never. It was, it was a concept that never really sat well with me. It still doesn't. I have a Toma logo. I do not. Ah, crap, baskets. That's okay. That's okay. We're just gonna go with the our backup option. Uh, which I will need to look for. Um, so we'll just hide this one for now. I've actually been putting some thought into this, and I've had an idea of what I kind of want to do um, moving forward with some of this stuff. Uh, here's a good example would be using Ema's card. So Ema does not really have like a set logo that I could find. What are we Actually, we're going to do something else with this. I want to leave this where it is right here, but we need to fill this space. So we're just going to create a rectangle. Fill it with that color. Get rid of the stroke. There we go. Maybe we need to move it down just like one more. Okay, that should do it. Oops. So yeah, I couldn't find like a solid logo for Ema, so I thought what I could do instead is uh do I have it? Yeah, here we go. So I could take this and we can grab the hat. I kind of got to do more or less by hand. It's a little trickier. I figured it would do that.
that. Now, is the hat, like, broken up right here? Is that what's going on in this spot? I can't really tell, but I don't think it matters that much. We'll just keep it. Go do that. Bring that over here. I don't know why it didn't smooth out as much as I wanted it to. Just have to do it, do it ourselves. Not typically a big deal. I just struggle doing this sort of fine touch-up stuff because... I have very shaky hands. <laughs> the dog has been going back and forth between whining at my door and running upstairs to bark at another door. I don't want to let you in my room if you're gonna <laughs> want to be let out two seconds later to go bark. I don't know what's going on today, but she's just very antsy. Okay. Oh, missed a spot. So that's part one. And then for anybody who... I mean, Ima's stuff tends to have... Like, his Twitter has the two flags and all that, so I'm thinking we could turn this into, like, a... Create something like this. Yeah, that's more or less what I'm doing. I'm mixing... So with this, what I'm doing is I'm mixing the the flags that Ima has. It's kind of like the Oshimark thing on his Twitter. <sighs> Need to... I'm blending it with... Uh, something that's iconic and I think people 
would readily recognize from him, which would be the hat. Oh, wait. It's the stroke. We want to change the fill. Oh, what flags... Is there... Is it a specific flag that Ima has on his... Hold on. Um. I don't know what this symbol is. Um, it's a flag. I, it, it's two flags crisscrossing. I know that much, but I don't know what specifically it is. Crossed flags. It's that's just what it's called. Is crossed flags. Okay, so is it... I don't know what the significance is. There's just a red dot in the center of the flags. Is that significant? Do it. Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> Whatever, man. Let's just add a red circle, I guess. I have no idea if it's significant or not. That didn't do what I wanted. There we go. Something like this, maybe? And then we'll probably need to shrink it down a bit. I mean, the flags are more like this.
How did a G-Force thing open up all of a sudden? <laughs> Okay, something like this, and then... Maybe something like that? Does that work? I don't know if that looks good at all. Um, I don't know. I guess it could work. It's, I'm not. I've, I'm not a hundred percent sold on it. I don't know. Something about it is just bugging me again. Something about. I just maybe that's just my some perfectionist bullcrap or something. But I don't know. It's, it's bugging me. It is bugging me too much. I can't with this. I don't know what it is, but something about it is bugging me so much. I just can't look at it. It's irritating me. I don't know what it is. It's bugging me. I can't do this. I can't figure out what's wrong. It's, it's that visceral of a reaction. It is that bad. I look at it and it irritates me so much. I just can't stand it. But I don't know what's wrong. Holy crap. That's better. It's not giving me that visceral ugh, re reaction anymore. I'm still not 100% satisfied with it, but I don't know if I ever will be. <laughs> oh, the joys of being, of creating things, you know? Just always be your biggest, you will always be your own biggest critic. <laughs> What the? 
Oh, I did fill instead of stroke. That's the problem. Okay, I'm just I'm realizing there's gonna be a problem here. I kind of want to incorporate the yellow in his design, but like that's not gonna look good. I can't imagine that looking good. Uh oh, doesn't look great. Doesn't it? Does it? Does, it, does, it mm. Now, to be fair, I am rather biased against yellow colors i hate yellow it bugs me so much i just do not like yellow at all it's a terrible color in my opinion this actually doesn't look bad just leaving it black i think that might work Why does it keep doing that color? I'm picking... I'm trying to pick the freaking... Why? It keeps... <laughs> okay, so... I click on this. I go over here to click fill, and it opens up a little color palette. The first color is right here. There's a little color box right here. It is this color. This reddish color. But for whatever reason, every time I click on it, it changes to this color. Every time. Look, just... Why? It's the wrong color. What is happening? What the crap? <laughs> no, it's still doing it. It's still doing it. This color. Thank you. Finally. Holy crap. How many hoops do I have to jump through to get you to work? <laughs> Oh, dear me. Uh, all right. I wonder if I do this, the, the blue that's in his eyes, would that work? Why is it down there? Or up there? I, yeah, I kind of like that. It works pretty well. Okay, what are we going to do for the text? We could just leave it black. Black could work. Blah. Yellow. I think black might work best. Yeah, I like it. I like it to stay in black. Okay. Oh, just gonna double check I'm spelling that right. Yeah, I am. Okay, so the reason why I did this one is to kind of show off what I'm thinking of doing with some of these moving forward. Um, because not all of the VTubers I've been doing this with have set logos, and then, um, some of the cards I've done before so here's an example um here we go 
So for Twee, I just did I just grabbed that and went with that. I'm not a fan of that anymore. I mean I was never really that big a fan of it to begin with, but I'm really just it's bugging the crap out of me now. I did it with Sylvie, I'm pretty sure it was another one. Yeah. So what I'm thinking is that for ones like this where I'm struggling with logo stuff, instead of doing a logo, maybe I switch over to like for Twee I could do the the leave the leaves on on her head the sprout on her head or something like that you know find some object that correlates with the character and use that instead i could even use if they have say um a certain mascot or something that resembles like chat or something you could use those i think uh using stuff like that will and I may end up changing to using that period, because it might fit better than a logo with a name or something. I don't know. I'm just going to play around with it and see how I feel about it. Oh, hold on. We missed a spot. So that's three cards that we've done. Now, in order to finish Toma's, I am going to need to grab probably just if there's a if she's got a picture or something that has like the specific style of like tomato image that she uses, I can use that. So I might save her card for another time. I don't know how much time I want to s spend on um, looking around for that stuff. On stream and all that, so... Let's see what else we can work with. Mm. I still want to find the artist who made this one. I do. I want to use this art piece, but I don't know the artist. Bugging me. No, I think having the inner color be something darker would fit better.
That's not bad. I'm kind of okay with this. I want something that's a little bit more of a mixture of... I don't want to go too relaxing with the music because it might put me to sleep, but at the same time as like going with the same background, just going through a whole uh, soundtrack thing is just kind of starting to get repetitive and old. So let's switch to something that's a bit more of a mixture of music. do have to be a little bit careful with Legend of Zelda music because um, if you go if you go with some of the there's some orchestral music music that's uh, done for Legend of Zelda and the problem with some of those tracks is some of those will be uh, DMCA'd. Which is Incredibly annoying, but Hyrule Cafe. This sounds like an interesting playlist. It is a lo fi, though. I don't know if I want to do lo fi. Ocarina of Vibes. <laughs> playlist name is that. What is it with everything just being lo fi now? It's not exactly a terrible type of music, but it's like... The top 50 Zelda songs from 2017. <laughs> Hmm. Death metal. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not actually that into metal. It, it, it can depend. Um, Instrumental-wise, sometimes it depends on if... Um, I don't do... I don't do writing as much as I used to. I probably I need to get back to it. I was creating a story for a long time. And it's still ro swirling around in my head, but when I would when I would work on bits of the story that were a little more intense and stuff, and sometimes I'd listen to more intense music to get the that kind of i that kind of atmosphere going for it but maybe i should get back into doing stuff like that. <laughs> don't listen to music as much as i used to back then
wonder if that's too big. It seems like it might be a bit too big. Let's just shrink it down a bit. There we go. A bit better. I, I could have sworn I had the artist name for this one. Hold on. That is their name, but I don't know if that's their Twitter handle. Luckily, Nemo did just start streaming, so I can quickly find a Twitter post. There we go. And I can just try to find the image real quick. See if he has... Uh... Well... Oh, there it is. Got it. We're only an hour in. We can do plenty more cards. <laughs> Although, real quick, let's let's work on this just so. Oh, I love this song. <laughs> this was one of my favorite parts of Twilight Princess because of the gameplay and the music. It was just like, all right, going all out with the Old West. <laughs> do it. It was such a brilliant idea on their part. Whoever was the person who came up with it is like, why don't we just do an Old West shootout in Legend of Zelda games? Like, that man needs a raise. <laughs> oh, that's a brilliant idea. Anyway. It was especially fun if you got, I don't ha, I didn't get a copy of it, but if you got a copy of the crossbow minigame thing and played that music to it, it's like, oh, so much fun. <laughs> I missed that Nintendo. The Wii era of Nintendo was like, let's just do whatever the crap we want. <laughs> Who cares? <laughs> Nintendo is often still very like that, but... I don't know, I feel like the, with the Switch, they they tend to be playing it more safe than they used to. With the Wii. With the, with the Wii, and to an extent, the Wii U, they were just kind of... I think the Wii U is kind of part of what killed their creativity. A little unfairly, but... Coming up with all crazy tech and ideas and things, and... I miss those days. I'm one of those people who thinks that the Wii U did not deserve as much all the hate that it got. Was it was it overly phenomenal? No, but it was still really good for what it was.
speaking of video games, I noticed that the uh, the ever ever beloved head of uh, Activision Blizzard is gone now. That man will forever live in infamy. <laughs> I don't think anybody will ever like him. And for good reason. I wonder if the company will finally be able to just, you know, both with the combined, being combined with Microsoft and getting rid of the really bad guy. <laughs> this is a, made a lot of dumb decisions, that man. I wonder if the com I hope and wonder if the combination of having that guy gone and Xbox merger maybe... Activision Blizzard can pick themselves up off the ground a little bit. Can hope. This is this song is from Breath of the Wild, I'm pretty sure. Hyrule Castle. Okay, so that's ready to go, so we can make more cards and add on to it when, when we're ready. Alright, what's next on our agenda list? Do I have a logo for Moy? Moyashi. Don't believe so, and I don't know what else to use yet, so we'll move on to something else for now. 
Pretty sure Afro Squirrel is the same deal. Uh, same with Darud. Do have something for Peachy though. Do that one. Ah, oh, this song. <laughs> oh, this brings back some wonderful and partially rage-inducing memories. <laughs> oh, the horse race from Ocarina of Time. Both one of the greatest parts of the game and one of the most aggravating. <laughs> this guy cheats. He's a jerk. <laughs> Which is kind of the point, but... It's been a long time since I last played Ocarina of Time. Kinda miss it all of a sudden. Fun game. Fun game. Uh, that might be a bit too dark. Did that. And I'll come back to that later. Do this color. Is there another one that we could work with? Maybe. We want it to be a dark color. That much is for sure. The outside of the card needs to be a darker color. No. There we go, it's far enough from white that it helps this blend in a little bit better. Maybe we'll add a shadow. I think we'll add a shadow to the logo. Help it out a bit. Yeah, there we go. That pops out a bit more. Without, you know, being too... Blah. <laughs> now for this. I'm still not... Sold on this color.
There's a slightly lighter version of this over here. What if we try that? No. This is from Wind Waker. Ah, oh, yeah, the mini boss theme. I love this song. <laughs> You always felt so awesome when this song was playing and you're just beating the ever-living crap out of like the, the big dudes in the full armor. You grab their own weapon, you just beat the crap out of them with it. <laughs> oh, good times. <laughs> Wind Waker was amazing. The power you wielded in that game was incredible. <laughs> this small child, you're just like, yeah, I'm gonna just pick up this massive sword that's three times my size. Whoa! <laughs> just go to town, <laughs> beating the tar out of the bad guys with it. Uh, so much fun. This. I'm hoping this is like a Laffy Taffy level pun that's about to happen here. <laughs> that's what I'm hoping. Whatever whatever this snowman joke is, I hope it's like a Laffy Taffy level pun. Yeah, that's fairly Laffy Taffy level. Well done. Congratulations. <laughs> Hmm, might be a bit too dark of a color. Yeah, slightly. Not this one. This one's slightly... Yeah, this one works better. I like this one. Why are my eyes blinking so much? I may, maybe that'll fix it. Uh, how do how does one know how single you are? I'll bite. I'll bite this bullet. Yeah, that 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 would do it. That uh, that would be like an instant KO <laughs> if that actually happened. If that actually happened to someone. I I don't think there would be any recovering from that. That's the end. It just it does not. There is no there is no lower you can go. I've never asked Siri anything. I've never had Siri on. I don't trust Siri. I view Siri as... <laughs> uh... I don't know why people love their voice activated cell phone peep things and whatnot. The, the series, the Alexas, all that stuff, I've never understood. <laughs> never understood why people like to use those things. They, they scare me. Should I darken this this color a bit? It's 
starting to think I might want to try darkening it just a little. Let's try this slightly darker color. Yeah, I think that flows a little bit better. Might be a little too dark, but I think it's good. Okay. Fun fact, actually. Uh, we just finished Peachy's card. Peachy's the one who made this chibi model that I'm using right now. <laughs> Very talented. Very talented artist. She's also the one who did the artwork for, for the card. Yeah, I've noticed that 9-11 jokes are starting to prop to pop up a lot in, uh, man, I just hate TikTok in general, but in a lot of modern TikTok humor, there's been a lot more 9-11 stuff and just, I, no, <laughs> that is, I, I find a lot of those videos to be in poor taste. If there's ways to make it genuine, there's ways to make even dark humor genuinely funny. The way they, the way these modern TikTok stuff does this dark humor, not in good taste. Typically not good. I, f I feel like we've kind of run the well dry on short form content for the most part. I think Vine kind of took care of that. A lot of the good quality short form content that we were going to get out of that kind of stuff came with Vine. And then after that, it just kind of died. Creativity is is a, kind of a dried well at this point, because all TikTok is is like, who's got the newest trend? OK, now everybody do that a thousand times until we get so tired of it. We're going to riot. <laughs> that is TikTok. I hate TikTok. It's a terrible, terrible place. The funny thing is, the only pla there are only three places where I watch TikTok videos. A, somebody links something that links it in like a Discord server, but it's not it's not one of those TikTok links that actually takes you to the website. It's just it was made on TikTok and then exported into an MP4 and just shared around. YouTube, and then the same thing, like just a TikTok video that was exported and uploaded on YouTube. And then again, TikTok exported, uploaded on Twitter. Those are the only three things. And it's always just uploaded in one. I like, I don't get involved in TikTok at all. <laughs> their website is, their website is scummy and not to be trusted. Their app is scummy and not to be trusted. So. I treat it as scummy and not to be trusted. <laughs> I feel like the music suddenly got a bit louder. There you go. Just, just a tiny bit quieter. I wonder if I should shorten this to just the mask. Hmm. No, we'll make a copy of it and we'll try it. We'll see how it looks.
And what we'll probably have to do is get a mask. color that uh, so what we're what we're doing is I am creating little Ooh, yes this looks this looks this looks pretty good. I like this. What the heck happened? <laughs> Hold on, I gotta fix that. Uh, we're making little trading cards for uh, some VTubers. Hello, VTubers. Um, it's technically I am one. Why is the stroke so jagged? I wonder if it's because I increased the size of the stroke and it got a bit messed up. get rid of the stroke and instead of a stroke we'll just bring back some of its own original edging maybe that'll look better oh maybe that's why it's messed up Actually, that doesn't look half bad. If I can make the colors around it work, then I think we could go with it. Okay, so basically what we're doing is we're taking different art pieces from VTubers, different fan arts that they have. We'll put them inside this uh, trading card style design, taking a different type of logo that they have, and we're just kind of crafting it all together into their own trading cards. This is, uh... I think the fifth time we've done this? The fifth... The fifth... Fifth stream? <laughs> I'm having a hard time saying fifth. <laughs> oh, dear. My brain is functioning just fine. No worries. We add this lighter. La no, 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 no. Better. 
but I still think it clashes way too much with the main color in the background. Oof. Hey, what about this? Ooh, that that had some good contrast. Kind of pops. That could be do that could be usable. Uh, let's just see how that color stands out with. I like, I like. So far, so good. Trying to get... Yeah, that looks wrong. Back to what it was before. It'll do. Okay. Here's what we can do. Do this again. We're going to leave a little bit more on this side this time. There we go. This way, this time, it should look a bit better. Yeah, it's roughly the same size. Now, got that. So, these back onto it. Stroke's a bit too jagged, so we'll leave the stroke off. Yeah, that does look a lot better. Awesome. Hold it off. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Well, off to bed. Have a good, have a good rest. Thanks for coming by. I appreciate it. Hope you rest well. Um, this would be a better option. Ooh, sneeze out of nowhere. <laughs> 3 a.m. And I get that I get that feeling. Staying up till 3 a.m. far too often. That looks okay. Ooh, what about this color over here? Not bad. Is it two S's or one? I'll just put two for now. We can double check. Oh. It was two. I do like what we have going on, but would it be better if I switched things up to f better fit this actual color scheme? like a lot of the color scheme that's in the art piece still fits it. Yeah, I'm I'm okay with this.
Okay, we'll do... We'll do one more. What else have we got? Pretty sure I have a set. We have a decent logo for Coco, but it'll take a little bit of work to get it pulled out. Echoes will probably be easier to pull out. Let's, let's go with Echo. Twilight Princess, Arrow Fields. back at some of the complaints we used to have or people in general used to have about video games I feel a lot emptier than they used to because <laughs> nowadays we just have these complaints of like why is this video game unfinished why is this video game just trash <laughs> the complaints used to be why is this video game just slightly not what I wanted I don't know I'll take the slightly not what we were look what we were expecting over <laughs> we have now at least back then they gave a crap and tried Take a look at this again when we finish the background color, because I'm sure when we add a specific background color, that'll show us some areas that we need to work on to finish fine tuning this. Okay. Echo's main color scheme seems to be around the pinks, purples, and blues. So, 
we'll focus our emphasis on those. There's a darker color over here. Not terrible. Could try to see if there's something darker. No, that's not. Um, not bad. I think the central area. I think the central area could be a little bit darker. Uh, maybe something that's around here. Oh, ooh, maybe like right here on these little ears. It's a good color. a bit too much. There we go. That did it. Nice. background too much. That's too dark. That's too much. It's not terrible. I don't know. Something about it doesn't quite sit right with me. Slightly better. We can maybe try oh. um. Fix this up. Just a bit 
I think, I think for my next batch, I should maybe focus a bit more on some of the more, some of the smaller VTubers who might escape notice. Maybe a goal should be one extra, one like larger VTuber per pack, per batch, and one smaller VTuber per batch. Like, my size is kind of small. Though so maybe a little bit bigger. I'm, I'm like the, uh, as about as small as it gets. More or less. A little bit larger than... You might expect from somebody just starting out, at least, but... You know, that general area. Of course, I could make hundreds of these and probably still not scratch the surface of just how many people that would or could possibly entail, but it's not like I plan to or expect to get every VTuber in existence. Just doing my best and just having fun with it. Drop Shadow kind of help is helping me find a few areas I missed. Tuning. It's a bit blurry, but not too bad at the the average viewing distance. I don't think it's too bad. I don't know. Okay. Whoops. Mm, maybe, maybe something else. I don't know. It seems to, uh, the contrast doesn't work as well with that as I would like. No. 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 I tend to struggle with a little bit working with uh, some of Echo's stuff just because a lot of her design stuff, and it's not a, necessarily a bad thing, but a lot of her stuff has a bit more in the brighter neon type colors. Those can be trickier to work with digitally. If Photoshop's trying really hard to get me to choose a color that's far more muted, because it blends much better that way. I think this one will work.
go. That down just a little bit. And That blends a bit better. Wait, I know I've heard this song. What is this song? Ah, I knew I know this song. I hate this song. It's the one of the few. It's one of the temples that took me forever to beat in Majora's Mask, the Stone Temple. I hate that place. Ugh, I never finished Majora's Mask. Though I don't feel too bad about it because that was my own choice. <laughs> I got to the end and reached a point where it's like, we want you to do this. So I just went, no, <laughs> I'm good. I, I'll pass. <laughs> so just nope. I noped right out of that. I had no intention of continuing that sanity. Okay. Wait, did I? Oh, okay, it didn't save this one. Okay, let's see. Got Echo, got... Ichi, see. Uh oh, I think we have an odd number. Not the end of the world, but. Yep, we got an we have a slightly odd we have an odd number. So I guess we could do one more. Just to even it out. Um We have Cleo, we've got Tane, Black, Zora, uh, Ohai, uh, crap. <laughs> I need for a second. Uh, crap baskets. Hers is, I don't, hers is going to take a little bit of work because I'm planning on pr turning this into the logo. Uh, Coco. Oh, we could do jets. Pretty sure I have it all ready to go. More or less. We'll do this one.
Yeah, I've got it pretty much all set. That should this one shouldn't be too tricky to figure out. There we go. Stroke is not working too well. Let's do a drop shadow. There we go, that's better. Just that, for whatever reason, Photoshop strokes are just so rough around the, I mean, look at the, look at these edges. They're just so jagged. I don't like it. I don't... I've never been able to find a... There's not really a setting that changes that. It's just... gonna be rough no matter what you do. It's not terrible, but again, it's just so jagged that it's just distracting. All right, let's see. I need another picture of jets because the colors are slightly different. <laughs> Um, I think this schedule, not this one, uh, schedule, there was a schedule image I found a second ago, that would work really well. I lost it. I lost it in seconds. Oh, there it is. We should be able to get a good color palette out of this image. A bit too bright. We can actually use utilize the darker image for the yes. Uh, orange, not, maybe not quite what we want. Hmm. This seems to fit fit Jet's color scheme pretty well.
doesn't work. Why does it do this sometimes? I'm actually pretty okay with this. Wait. They didn't actually... There's no way... They do the art on this themselves? Hold on, I need to find this image again. Something's up with that. They, they could have done it themselves. I'm pretty sure Jets does do art. They just want to double check. I didn't name it after them... Just because... I don't know where that image is anymore. Crap. <laughs> ah, crap baskets. Okay, yeah, it does seem to be done by Jets themselves. Okay, cool. So I did get that right. Okay. Okay, so here's a slight... <laughs> Guess we'll just do both. Because they go by jets, but all of their stuff's is Jean famous, so I'm just like, I don't know which one. <laughs> I remember that. I remember them saying at one point they preferred jets. I think. I'm trying to remember that was a while back. Oh, let's just, uh, well, I'm just gonna do both and <laughs> hope that's good. Wait, does that look... I want to change the outer edge. I don't know. Something about it just suddenly started bugging me a little bit. Oh wow, that much, that that is better. I like that much better. I like that a lot. I like black a little bit.
This one just does not want to fit, apparently. It is fighting me every step of the way. I wonder why it's doing this. It's the same size as all the others. Okay, there we go. I had to force it a little bit, but it... It's now. Okay. Yeah, that one worked perfectly. I don't know what the issue is with this one. It was this, it made it the exact same as all the others, but for whatever reason, it just did not want to fit. Ocarina of Time, Temple of Ta Temple of Time song. One I've heard about a billion times for <laughs> extended periods of time.
having the same problem so I'm just gonna force it to fit luckily it's not a big problem All right. Wow, we got eight done this time. Oh, oh man. <laughs> Batch number five, eight whole cards. That's, uh, Yeah, that's two more than our next most, which was the first batch where we did six cards. So we did six, then four, then five, then four, and now eight. <laughs> Ooh, that was a lot of work. I mean, not... Eh, you know what I mean. All right. Um... Oh, Nemo's still streaming. How long is he going to be streaming for? I want to raid Nemo. He's been streaming for nearly two hours, so he might still go for a little bit longer. So we're going to raid Nemo. Alright. I can type correctly. <laughs> Alright, folks. Thank you very much for coming by. Hope y'all had fun. Thank you for joining me as I got some more work done on some more cards. And, uh... We'll see what next week brings us. I still have one more week before my next semester starts, so... We'll see what ends up happening. I have a lot of editing I need to catch up on, but... Well, until next time, I hope y'all have a good one. And I hope to see you all again another time. Bye-bye.